Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am Youngblade. Welcome to my first ever Go video where I play a Blitz game against my computer. I'm going to give my computer a two stone handicap. Let us begin. I take the upper left corner. The computer plays 5-4, so I play on this side. Since he has a high stone down there, I want to reduce on that side of the board. Well, we play out a pretty standard Joseki here. Black doesn't finish, instead he plays down there. So I decide to take away the corner move so that he doesn't get a nice enclosure down there. He approaches me high on top, not really sure why. I guess he didn't want me to play a pincer of some kind. I just back off instead of playing the attachment, and we play out this normal Joseki. So I approach the last corner now, and he plays this uh, influence-oriented move. I guess he figures the left side is really important. Uh, I poke at the shape point. And then I decided I need to reduce the left. I could play on the right, that's the larger side of the board, but I want to, since Black has said that he really wants this side of the board, I want to play over there now uh, so that I can challenge that directly. Uh, if your opponent ever wants something, you should ask them, are you sure you really want that, is kind of the general philosophy I follow. Uh, and after that, I jump away, and Black tries to make some shape for himself so his group can live locally, but that's not quite alive, so I poke at it a bit. Uh, and then he jumps out, and I decide to profit from the attack, because 6th line territory is really awesome. He jumps out, and then I need to make myself stronger. I make some shape for myself. He comes back to the corner, I fix, and then I jump over, letting him have the corner. I'm not gonna fight over that, I'm not gonna even bother with the Hane or anything. I just wanna... I, I wanna be done with this area, so that I can come back and focus on the weak group, which is still not alive. Unfortunately, my group is also weak, so I have to make it a little bit stronger before I come back for an attack. Black decides he really wants the corner, that's fine, I'll let him have it. Uh, I do want to fix there because I don't want to become too weak down there. Black leans over here, and so I decide to do a leaning attack, leaning against the corner on top, and then I begin to surround the black group. He then tries to make some shape for himself, and I just want to keep myself strong, no weakness, plus I'm getting a lot of territory out of this. Uh, I play the Atari there, of course, because it's free, and then I fix, so I have no weaknesses there, the top side is now basically mine. I make sure that I fix my shape, stay strong, and then here, I don't really agree with what Black did, uh, because there's a gaping weakness at F12. And I read it for a second, but this is a Blitz game, I can't read it for too long, I decide to take the cut, and then, well, the computer just ignores. So I'm like, okay then? I think about a couple moves and I decide I'm just gonna stay strong, split directly, and now Black is split, he decides to keep me split, so I'm gonna stay strong again keep black split, and then he comes back because he doesn't want me to stay connected, and I fix. So now black's group has to live locally. Uh, I'm going to call shenanigans on that. I don't think it can. I poke, and then he plays on the outside again. I'm not really sure why. I think the computer's just misreading and thinking that he's still alive. He does get this nice move here, and this almost trips me up, but I actually have a sente move here to prevent the connection underneath. By playing this, if I extend that stone now, then either his three stones die or his two stones die. So then I'm able to come back, finish up the monkey jump, and he pokes at my shape a bit, but effectively those black stones are now dead. I just keep myself strong, make sure they stay dead. And now uh, the game has kind of fallen into my favor since I killed that corner. My The top side of the board in that corner is enormous. He threatens to take that away. I just fix now. I'm, I'm ahead. I don't need to do anything else too fancy. I defend against that. I don't understand this move at all, but whatever, I just take his stone. Uh, he threatens to connect under, I obviously don't let him. He then Atari's a stone, and I just take. Uh, he pokes, I defend, I just want everything, as long as everything I have on the board lives, I can win this game easily. Uh, I want to get that Incente so I can jump out here, have plenty of space to make eyes. I poke here, uh, just trying to stay strong, get some shape because I'm ahead. I, I like to follow that philosophy of once you're ahead, just stay ahead, don't worry about uh, trying to do anything fancy or winning by a million points. Uh, so for the rest of this, it's mostly just uh, me reducing Black's potential in the center, which there is some. I mean, it's, it's not absolutely hopeless for Black. Uh, I also try to take this away on the side, just forcing Black to connect there and then connecting under myself, so that way the bottom side becomes a lot... Uh, less uh, less good, less developed. Uh, then I have the option here, I could connect up uh, all my stones there, but since I've already killed his stones, that doesn't really matter. Uh, he pokes again, and I just go back. Uh, there is actually an option there for Black to do something, and, and the computer does take advantage of it later, but I don't really care, I'll give up the one stone gladly. 
See, I'm like, oh yeah, I can't connect, but whatever, I'll give up the one stone. And then I Atari, and Black doesn't save his three stones, so I just take them back. And that's fine. Uh, for me, that's fine. And, uh, yeah, the rest of the game, pretty much, I, I just try to find moves to reduce. This can't be disconnected. Uh, Black does a poke through a bamboo joint because he thinks that's good. Uh, yeah, I... That's why I had to give my computer a two-stone handicap here. I I could have given it even more, but I've never done a Blitz game against my computer before. So I didn't know how well I would do, and I, as you can see, I, I have a lot less time than the computer does, but I'm still doing fine. And here, I just want to make sure this is dead. So I just... No eyes at all. I can now come back and kill that at my leisure, so he... Because my, my group there in the center doesn't actually have two eyes. Uh, and he pokes at it a lot. I could make two eyes for it right away, but there's other things I want to do. I want to keep reducing and just make sure that I've got this win. Uh, I don't... I think Black could have disconnected me there, but whatever. Uh, yeah, so we play out the rest of this. I just fix everywhere, poke, make sure that Black doesn't get anything else. He kind of does that thing, and I'm like, oh, I'll just do that. I realize later I should have just made two eyes for my group, because then... I have no problems anyway, uh, and I actually do get around to that. I make a point here, and then come back, play that, computer obviously fixes, and after a couple of pokes, I finally do come back and I'm like, well, I might as well just make two eyes for my group, because black isn't preventing me from doing that, so I never need to finish that capturing race. I pass, computer passes, and after scoring, I am ahead by... It takes me a second here, I, I forget how this works, uh, that it automatically scores. Hit done, I have won by 37 points. So, GG, well played computer. Thank you guys all for watching this first video of mine. Uh, again, once my new computer gets here, I hope to be doing more Minecraft and KSP videos. Have a wonderful day.